What's up, babes? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another vlog. If y'all do not know me, my name is Chrissy. Hello and welcome. So, y'all, uh, this week, honestly, okay, I don't know if it's gonna be a weekly vlog or a weekend vlog but it's currently Wednesday and the only reason I'm vlogging today is because I'm going to meet up with Sienna we haven't had any one-on-one -on -one time in a minute so we're gonna go to this coffee shop called Lala Kind Cafe in Santa Monica it's so freaking cute like I've been on their Instagram and I've been obsessed with their Instagram it's like white and like just crisp and clean and really cute. So we're gonna go up there, have some coffee. They have like a really good cause behind the place. Um, I believe they like work with um, youth that's in foster care and like give them jobs and like training and stuff like that. So we love coffee and we love a good cause, okay? We love a good matcha and supporting a good cause. <laughs> so we're gonna go do that. Also, Loki wanna get some content there because it's just cute. That's why I was like, you know what? Let me pick up my camera and vlog. At first I was like, I'm just gonna enjoy coffee, but I feel like we're both gonna wanna get some content because it's really cute. So um, I'm also gonna do that. I am currently uploading a video it has 41 seconds left it's not the upload time that I'd be super worried about it's the processing time and I'm supposed to go get her at 1 so we can head out and try to get back before traffic starts we're gonna have to get on 405 so that's gonna be crazy but yeah I'm excited very excited to go to this coffee shop and also later on the week Sienna's birthday is next week but on Saturday we're going wine tasting like we're going to uh vineyards and stuff in Temecula so it's gonna be so fun all the girls are gonna be together so yeah y'all this vlog should be lit but today I'm not gonna do a full OOTD guys you guys have seen this outfit I have on my good American um essential little sports bra and the matching leggings um y'all seen this in another like day in the life video i did but i did but i did this like cream cardigan that y'all have also seen for misguided instead of the brown trench because it's hotter outside also mind your business that I'm wearing this outfit again, like, hello, of course. But I never got a picture in this outfit. I never got a good picture. So I'm trying to get a picture at the cafe, hopefully. It's not too busy. But I'm going to finish this video. It's processing. What's well, processing will begin shortly. And then I will see y'all either in the car or at the cafe. Recruiting isn't an option. 
seen that movie la la kind cafe in santa monica and it is so cute the vibes the aesthetic <laughs> is immaculate like it's so cute inside like it's just like crisp crisp white <laughs> clean like it's kind of like beigey white hints of yellow because there's a little bit of like yellow in there like it is really cute but they did not have so we went in there we're like yes i'm gonna get some avocado toast like y'all know i love a good piece of avocado toast like one thing about me when i go get coffee especially at like a coffee shop if you sell avocado if you sell avocado toast i'm getting it okay so we were like yes i'm gonna get the avocado toast i know exactly which one i want blah, blah, blah. girl get up to the register they talk about we sold out of toast. I said, what do you mean you sold out of toast? They like, we don't have any more bread for the day. Mind you, it's like two o'clock on a Wednesday. Like, please, you're a coffee shop. Um, however, I don't know. Maybe there's a bread shortage. I just really don't know. So then me and Sienna being the foodies that we are, we were like, absolutely not. It's two o'clock. Neither one of us have eaten. So we put in our <laughs> drink orders and then there was a Whole Foods right across the street. So we went to Whole Foods and got food because I'm like, I'm not just sitting here sipping on a matcha. Like if we're going to be sitting here for a minute, he can. Sorry, I'm doing my lean cuisine child. I'm going to have a lean cuisine for dinner. It's a chicken enchilada. They're good. Um, if we're going to sit here and kiki, then, oh wait, sorry. All right, I don't have to cut it. Anyways, um, we gotta eat. So we went over to Whole Foods. It was literally across the street. And we got sandwiches. I had the classic tuna sandwich, it was delicious. And we had some chips and then, um, you know, so we came back to La La Cafe and we ate in there and had our drinks. It was just so cute, you guys, like the vibe, chef's kiss. Um, and then we caught up, so I didn't like vlog too much because I have to catch, I have to catch my good girl up, like I have to catch this up. So then after that, we went across to this bakery that um, she spotted across the street where she was like, you wanna go to the bakery? I was like, you gotta send me some little word. And um, it was so cute, it was like all pink inside. Also Santa Monica on the same street, it was like literally across the street from each other. So if y'all wanna visit those places, then I'll leave links to everything down below. But it was woman owned, um, the kitchen manager that runs like all the locations was black. I say, girl, and it was just so cute. So I got this like um, lemon blueberry little loaf and she got, I think she got banana or something like that, but girl, I said, not you having me off my little eating diet today. And, like, I'm really not on a diet. I just intermittent fast and try to make, like, better choices. But I was carving it up today. So I'm just home having a lean cuisine, girl. And that's one thing, like, I feel like because I'm trying to get on my, like, you know, fitness, moving my body every day, making sure I feel good. And I did work out this morning, period. Anyways, um... I just feel so much better and I move a lot easier like we were walking and doing stuff and even like me sitting in like low seats were so much easier to get out of because you guys know like I have an injured leg so I just see a lot of changes and I also don't feel as bad when like maybe I don't eat great one day like I feel like I didn't eat my best today, but I do feel like I still made like some good choices over other even though I had a sweet a little dessert 
like I don't want to feel bad if I decide to go out with a friend and have a dessert you know what I mean I don't want to feel bad if I feel like to have some carbs today you know what I mean so I think that's what intermittent fasting does for me it kind of takes some of the pressure off of me and I also saw this TikTok and they were like um you know the reason why a lot of people it's hard for them to lose weight is because they go from like Monday through Sunday, like junk food, junk food, junk food, junk food, junk food, like bad food, carb, 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 straight to greens, greens, eating clean, eating clean, eating clean. But then Saturday and Sunday, you treat yourself. And she's like, the way you get balanced and really get your body in the mood is like, you know, it shows like Monday and you have like greens, greens, like it was like, you know, it was like the green salad emojis and then like a slice of pizza in there. Like, you know, it's like eat normal. Like maybe I eat salad all day and then I had a slice of pizza for dinner. Like, you know what I mean? So it's things like that. And I have found out that like when I deprive myself is when it just doesn't work for me. You know what I mean? Like I end up having a cheat day and going overboard or I end up, um, you know, just falling off the wagon, you know, and that's one thing I, I don't want to do this time. That's why I'm like, I'm really not on a weight loss journey. I'm on a lifestyle change journey because I want this to be permanent. Like I want to be healthy, period. I don't want to just do it for a period of time and then I lose weight because I have a tendency to do it for being a really strict diet lose the weight I want to lose and then once I realize like oh I'm losing weight I have a tendency to like get comfortable and then start eating crazy again and I know that's me I like I know it's a self-control thing but it's a habit in myself that I've noticed and I would like to stop repeating because okay I have to recover this Ciao. It's taking too long to cook this little dinner. Um, it's just been a habit that I've noticed and I would like to very much stop so that I can stay consistent. My little lean cuisine is ready. My little enchilada. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I don't wanna hear anything about lean cuisine has so much sodium in it. Girl, I have these so I can just have something quick to eat when I need to eat like I need to do right now and I don't cook often like it's not that I don't I just don't cook often I cook you might get one to two good meals out of me it's like but yeah so I'm gonna eat my dinner and then I'll probably see y'all tomorrow okay Hola, babes. <laughs> that was weird. Hola, como estas? I'm in a good mood. It is Friday. Tomorrow is Saturday. We're going wine tasting with our girls. But anyways, um, today is Friday, baby. I'm sitting on a full take of gas. My dad, okay, so let me tell you. Uh, I don't live too far from my church. So my dad went up to the church uh, this morning. And then he called me. He's like, you need anything before I leave the area? And I was like, you know, <laughs> closed mouths don't get fed, baby. I was like, I can use a full take gas because I was on low and I'm driving out to my sister's house today um baby he was like bet me at the gas station I said ah! when I tell y'all my parents are like angels like when they go to heaven baby that house gonna be sick that house gonna be sitting on a hill <laughs> on a hill <laughs> they gonna be next door neighbors to Abraham and him because my parents <laughs> are the best people in this world like shout out to y'all still making sure your 26 year old is good you know what I'm saying gas is wild my dad said it took almost a hundred dollars to fill my car up and y'all I drive a small SUV it has never taken that much like gas in LA is wild right now it is seven dollars like I kid you not it is wild at the moment but you know what I saw this TikTok and it was this pastor and he was saying he was like you know I was filling up my car and I wanted to participate in the trend of like posting how much you know my gas and you know being mad about the gas prices and then he was like but you know what 
I, um, my spirit stopped me and just said, thank you, Lord, and was thankful that I had the funds to put gas in my car. And when he said that, I was like, dang, he's right. I'm sitting here, you know, complaining about how high gas prices are, which they are. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. It's ridiculous. However, it's just like, thank you, Lord, for the funds, you know? Thank you for my parents, too. Like, you know, and thank you, Lord, for this car. Thank you, Lord, for, you know, providing for me to be able to put gas in my car. And I think that he just put a lot into perspective. And sometimes um, we're so ready to complain. But, you know, we got to put things into perspective. And I think that the prices will go down. I just think they just wildin' at the moment. Why? I don't know. But they need to go down for summer because... I'm trying to be outside. Anyways, um, so yeah, like I said, today's Friday. I'm on my way to my sister's house to hang out and to also babysit. I babysit for her once a month so that, um, you know, her and my brother-in-law can go out and have a date night. And I love seeing my babies. Also, y'all, I don't know if you noticed, but I did switch my hair up, baby. I got to give y'all the middle part body wave bust down from asia j asia j on the head uh, this hair you guys i'm gonna give you a close-up but i just didn't want to like gloss over it because i know you see i know you see me um but this hair y'all is so what she said okay this hair is so nice like i kid you not like asia j babes she sells like such good quality hair it's just gorgeous. Like, it's really nice. Like I said, I'll give y'all a little close-up later. But have y'all seen... You know what's cracking me up? Have y'all seen that um, that TikTok where it's like, I feel Puerto Rican. <laughs> I feel like a Puerto Rican. <laughs> as soon as I put this hair on, that's how I felt. I'm going to do a TikTok for it, too. I feel Puerto Rican. Bitty, bitty, oh, mom. <laughs> That TikTok be having me dying, but baby, I have to switch the hair up for tomorrow's look, and I'm hoping that tomorrow's look comes together because I had to. I bought an outfit from Pretty Little Thing, um, and I did express shipping because I ordered it on Wednesday. I got that bad, um, but I ordered it on. I hate when motorcycles drive near me because. No. Um, anyways, I, I ordered it on Wednesday. You know, pretty little thing is based in the UK. Um, so Use the left two lanes to keep left I was like, I, I hope it gets here in time. And thank God it is. Like, God be really watching out for me. And, but it's being delivered to my parents' house when I could have sworn I put my address on it. So thank God again, my dad has to come back down um to the church tomorrow so i'm gonna have him drop the package off to me or i get it um in the morning i also gotta go to miss lola i bought some these like sandals to go with my outfit and like a bag so hopefully that'll be ready for me to pick up you know what my toxic trait is my toxic trait is i always think i gotta get something new for everything that i go to like i always think i gotta rewear you know get a new outfit for everything and you know what i don't even think that's really my fault i'm gonna put that on my parents um more specifically my mother because every little program every holiday every we had new outfits like and that's just what it was and then she would be on my case today as an adult like you always buy new outfits because that's how you programmed me you know how black moms are like that's how you program me easter new dress christmas new dress programs new dress everything new outfit like so i'm going to the winery tomorrow and i wanted to give winery but i hope my outfit works out it's like a cute little dress and i size down in it because y'all i lost 10 pounds and i think i'm skinny honey and then um i have this like white beach shirt to like go over it you know just kind of like over my shoulders a little drape drape moment and yeah so i want to just give grown sexy and winery I feel like I need to fix my lace a little bit when I get home. But yeah, y'all. I was going on today. And I'm be finding gummy worms in my car. That's the devil right here. The devil is busy. <laughs>
Okay, y'all. So, I'm back home. I feel like the lighting looks so weird. Um, don't mind the little stains on my shirt. I was babysitting a two-year-old and a six-month-old today. However, I'm going to give you a little close-up of this hair. Is this hair not gorgeous? I have not crimped this, braided this, nothing. Like, this is the hair texture with a little water um, conditioner, a little Miss Jackie's, and some bio oil. I think that's what it's called. Is it called bio oil? Y'all know what I'm talking about. Um, a little bit of hair oil, like Asia J. She's really that girl. Like, she's really that girl for the tresses, for the hair, for the wigs, for everything. She's such a sweetheart. This hair is gorgeous. I'm obsessed. And it's a 5x5 five five closure. I've never worn a closure before. And I tried to make it look like a frontal as much as I could. It's just gorgeous hair. Like, I feel like I put her. Anyways, I just got home. And I got home to some packages. So I'm going to open them up real quick before I go to bed. I'm lying. I'm not even about to go to bed. It's late, too. It's like 1030. But the time change is just be having me so off. Um, but I need to make sure that I have everything ready for tomorrow because I need to be at Santa's before 11 because we're trying to leave by like 11, 11, 15. And we're content girls. So I need to make sure that my camera battery is charged, charged. I need to make sure I have my tripod. I need to make sure both of my portable lights are charged. I need to make sure my phone is charged. I need to make sure I find all my accessories, my sunglasses. Like, I do not want to be frazzled tomorrow because I'm always freaking frazzled every time I have somewhere to go. Anyways, this first package is from Morphe. I ordered some stuff. I got my Morphe Continuous Setting Spray because, baby, if you don't have this, you know what? It's between this, um, Urban Decay. Okay, obviously these two make my makeup look the best but also I have been hearing from the girls on TikTok that the Charlotte Tilbury um oh I forgot the name of it anyways it's by Charlotte Tilbury it's a setting spray and I heard that that is like it so I want to try that I need to go to Sephora maybe I'll go on Sunday and then I got this out and about um lip kiss the caramel nude also saw this on TikTok my girl Key reviewed it after she saw another TikToker review it and it was so gorgeous on her so I was like oh I gotta try it because I'm a whore for <laughs> for a brown lip liner and a brown nude moment like I love a new lip I also got this glam bronze um eyeshadow palette wait is this the bronze no this is the bronzer yeah this is the bronzer it's a face and body bronzer it's actually really big hold on let me open this i really hope i got it in the right color i got it in big shop but sometimes i feel like this is a good color yeah because your bronzer doesn't really like it's not your contour it doesn't need to be that dark i mean it's a little light i don't know i'm gonna have to see um I just wanted to try their bronzer. It had really good reviews. Also, I need another bronzer. And sometimes, like, I should have went to the store. Because sometimes, like, I think I'm darker than what I am. Sometimes I think I'm lighter than what I am. And I feel like I fall, like, in the middle. I'm, like, a good, like, milk chocolatey type of tone. And then I got this 90 Neutral um eyeshadow palette and i'm not an eyeshadow girl however i do like to put like bronzy kind of like skin tone colors just on my lid like when i do my makeup so my lid is not so my lid is not naked but i don't like the glitters and stuff but who knows like i might wanna i might wanna switch it up you know what i'm saying um this next package is from beauty counter which i didn't even know i was getting a beauty counter package i guess this is pr very excited about this I've gotten packages from Beauty Counter um, before, but I haven't got one in a while. So I didn't know if I was still on the PR list. So. Um, hopefully, Beauty Counter is makeup, so hopefully it's just some good product. It says, show me some skin. I know that's right. Is it a bronzer? Is it a moisturizer? Oh, Okay. Is a reflect effect aha smoothing facial mask. Yes. <laughs> I love when people send me skincare. Like sometimes makeup is like, uh, because I'm very particular with my makeup. And I don't, honestly, I don't wear that much makeup. But skincare, baby. This is so freaking cute. Okay. So this is their reflect effect 
Hey, ooh, it's heavy, child. We love a heavy um thing, especially when it comes to skincare. Like, I feel like it's so luxurious and yum. I'm trying not to mess up the packaging too much so I can do a little Insta story. But this is the Beauty Counter Reflect Effect AHA Smoothing Facial Mask. Very excited about that. Because remember I've been telling y'all, like, my skin... I don't know. My skin's kind of been going through it. I feel like I kind of have it together now. Well, I have my makeup right now. But I feel like I kind of have it together now. But I love anything that is hydrating and just, like, good for my skin. And I have, like, combination skin. I don't have sensitive skin. So I'm pretty open to products. Like, products don't really affect my skin in a negative way. Okay, so the mask is clinically proven to improve skin texture and tone. Love. Improve skin radiance, exfoliate, and resurface skin. Love that. And you know what? I've been looking for something that is just like exfoliating to my skin. I feel like that's what my skin needs. A really good like exfoliating situation. I really need to go get a facial. And then it comes with a little face spatula. Um... It's a easy to clean silicone skincare tool, ideal for use with our AHA smoothing facial masks and other facial oils and, sim and serums, spatula in for mess free application, bristle side for easy exfoliation and product removal, Ooh, massage side for work in post mask skincare for a soothing pre mask face massage. Love that. I love that. You guys, you know, I love a self-care moment. I love a self-care day. I love a self-care morning, night. But yeah, y'all, that's my little mini haul of packages that I got today. I think I'm going to try this tomorrow. And I'm going to show you guys this just in case you're wondering how it looks. So I'm up to make sure that I have everything that I need for tomorrow. I do kind of want to go to bed before 12. I'm about to tie down my hair. That's another thing about this hair. The maintenance is so easy. I didn't even tie it down last night. Like, this is straight out the bonnet. I didn't brush it this morning. Nothing. Like, it just looks this fire. So, yeah. I'm going to put her website, Instagram, and everything down below because, baby, the only thing I personally did to it was dye it pitch black because, you know, all my hair has to be pitch black. So, yeah, I'm about to go make sure I have everything ready for tomorrow because I have to get up really early, go grab my outfit from my dad, and go pick up my shoes and my bag, which they haven't told me my pickup order is ready, but I'm just going to go up there and make them get it ready. Like, what are we doing? So, yeah, y'all, I will see you tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be so much fun. I'm so excited. Babes. So, I'm doing this so quickly because I have to go. I do not want to be like, like, Christine Nicole Bingham is not the one that is going to make everyone late today. However, I have on my little outfit. It's so stressful because my dad literally dropped off my outfit this morning. Remember I told you guys the package got sent to their house, not my house, blah, blah, blah. Whatever. So, y'all know who I am. Freaking out a little bit. However, I think I pulled it together. It's kind of cute. It's kind of giving, like winery you know first things first though can we start off with accessories and the jewelry you guys my jewelry is from Anna Louise I'm so excited y'all uh, okay so let's start off with this gorgeous ring I mean my gosh it's like a I was like a chunky not even chunky just a beautiful like thick gold ring you guys I'm obsessed with it it fits so perfectly and it goes with me y'all know I love a good gold moment I also have one these mini hoops they're like rope mini hoops i'm obsessed with the mini hoop i don't know what it is as i've gotten older i've wanted less of like the big hoops and it's just like the mini hoops are so dainty so feminine you guys all this jewelry is so heavy and gold and gorgeous like the quality giving now the star of the show baby this bracelet right here is gorgeous okay it's like a rolex chain bracelet i'm obsessed with it also obsessed with the fact that it comes with the extra link for the thick curls okay for the girls with a thick wrist it's so freaking cute their jewelry is so um their jewelry is so affordable so luxury so quality like i'm obsessed with it i don't know why i haven't worn it before i also have this necklace from them and this necklace is gorgeous i didn't know if I was going to wear it with this outfit and now I do kind of want to wear it with this outfit. It's more of like a choker. Um, 
kind of I forgot what type of chain this is called you guys I'm gonna put this all down below everything on the screen but I want to share this with you guys because they sent me these gorgeous pieces you guys are always asking where you can find good accessories and where um, I get my accessories from you know I'm a whore for I can stop saying that <laughs> y'all know I love a good gold moment so this chain is just so beautiful you know what I am gonna stack this chain this is actually really cute it's giving grown and sexy and luxury okay yeah this is actually fire I can't believe I wasn't gonna wear it well I put it in my purse because I didn't know I was gonna wait and see what the girl said but this is cute I love all the stacked necklaces usually I don't like like a it's not a choker it's just a really close fit or either I just have like a really thick net but I think it's so cute to just layer and stack like this and they also sell necklace sets where it is stacked like this so I love this you guys as always I will have the clickable links for you down in my um, description box they do have a promotion going on right now their March Madness promotion where you can get 20% off the site and I will also have my own personal code for you guys down in the description so if you want some luxury beautiful jewelry for an affordable price make sure that you check out Anna Luisa honey I'm actually I have been waiting for them to hit me up for a while because I was like obsessed with their jewelry I was seeing it on like Kayla cake she wears it all the time and it just looks so good the hoops I'm obsessed with right now just the whole look I'm kind of obsessed with okay so let me show you guys the entire outfit so this is my outfit for today hopefully it looks cute on camera like I feel like it's cute in person but I also was like trying to pull it together you know so I have on this halter it's supposed to be a maxi but it's fitting a little more like a midi from a pretty little thing I have on this oversized like white b-shirt that I just tied up I have off the shoulders also from pretty little thing my clutch is from this Lola thank god for them because I literally went this morning and picked them up that's why I'm like in a tizzy right now and then I have one of these cute little like slides they're also from Miss Lola I do a close up of everything too and hopefully I can get some cute content and cute video because of course y'all come with me and then I also have an extra pair of heels like for pictures and you know if I want to change it to heels but she did say like a lot of the wine tastings today are like stand-up tables so bring some comfortable shoes so I have these on for the ride and I'll bring the heels just in case I think I want to tuck this in a little bit maybe I just needs to be like a little tighter I don't know but you guys this is the outfit I hope it's cute I hope it's translating like I like oh I also have these glasses I need to go. I also have these glasses to go with it. I just feel like it's giving grown. I feel like it's giving grown sexy going to a winery type of vibe. Love the actually live for the glasses. With this fit, the glasses are from Amazon. You already know it's in my storefront. So yeah, you guys, this is the fit. And I need to go. So I might talk to you guys in the car. Or I will just see you guys when we get to Temecula. Yeah. Okay guys. So I'm in the car. You know what? I feel like so much boob is out and I really don't like that. Like I don't, I don't know. I just don't really like to have my boobs out like that lately. I just don't, I don't know. <laughs> I might have to fix it. I'm probably going to have to tie the halter up a little bit. And I have a boob tape. It's just all a thing, you guys. I feel like I'm so frantic all the time when I have somewhere to go. But it's really because, like, today I just didn't have my outfit. Like, this is my first time trying it on. I still feel like this dress, like, I feel like it fits. But in some areas, it's a little big. And I sized down it because I knew, like, a pretty little thing I just sized down. I sized down to uh, extra, extra large, like... <laughs> You know what I mean? So it's just like a little off, but it's fine. Dang, I want to get over so bad. No, I have to get over. Like, people drive so slow, and like, I have somewhere to go. Anyways, I forgot to tell y'all that I have on Angel Share today. It's my fragrance. I didn't even think about it, honestly. I didn't think about the vibe. I didn't think about anything. I was just like, listen, I feel like Angel Share is the one. And it's always a good one. So I was just like, I'm going to put it on. But yeah, I'm just so frantic. But I'm really excited to go and just drink wine all day. <laughs> and get it. Because I have a drink. In a minute. And I also have eaten. I know we're going to eat in the car. And then we have reservations. Um, 
when we get out that way but i'm just so excited to be with the girls you know we always give them looks you know we're always a whole vibe so and i need this i just feel like my week has been so stressful my emotions have been all over the place i've been dealing with so much i have to tell you guys well no i'm not even gonna tell you guys i'll keep this to myself maybe i don't know but yeah i'm just so excited for this day so i'm gonna turn on my music so i can calm my nerves a little bit and then i will see you guys in some my car last night because girl when I got home I was so tired I went straight to bed but today's Sunday have on my little savage onesie and I'm chilling right now um I girl I snatched my wig off last night and so it's just me and my wig braids at the moment <coughs> excuse me anyways yesterday was so <coughs> yesterday was so much fun with the girls we almost we always have so much fun together celebrating Tiana's birthday in Temecula wine tasting and all that chilling that night ended so so well like it was just so fun such vibes you know y'all already know what it is when we link up okay period um but no I always value my time with them like it's just so great to be around like like-minded people and have like really good like-minded friends so hopefully you guys will see more of them in my vlog I mean you will see more of them in my vlog um also it's really something I meant to tell you guys and I don't remember what it was watch me remember it as soon as I'm done filming this because I had to put the intro in real quick I'm literally editing this vlog to put out today like a quick turnaround so yeah you guys also don't forget to check out Ana Luisa Jewelry 
It'll be linked down below in the description box. The jewelry pieces were so good. They did so good all night. I got compliments on it. Like, they were such cute pieces, such luxury, just like quality pieces. They do have a promotion going on for their mat March Madness sale. 20% off the site, and I believe I have a code as well to share with you guys. So make sure you guys check them out. Honestly, I think that's like my favorite new jewelry company. You know, like, I love an accessory. I love a little detail. I love a little one-two. So I swear I'm going to be getting my jewelry from now on and definitely recommend it to y'all as well. So make sure you guys check them out. Also, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on this video. Y'all already know I'm trying to get to 100K this year. And liking this video helps spread the video to all the girls that need to be a part of the fam. You know what I mean? So I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next one. Mwah.